More than 2,600 families have now fled their homes due to the massive gas leak in Porter Ranch, California, a suburb of L.A. But the CEO of the company responsible for the leak says the danger has been overblown. He spoke exclusively with Mireya Villarreal. How far are we from the well right now? We're probably less than uh, a mile. Southern California Gas Company CEO Dennis Ariola asked to do this interview as close to the leak as possible. So we're closer than the homeowners. Are you uncomfortable? No, absolutely not. I've been out here almost every day since October 23rd. I feel totally safe. Ariola says the gas company is close to finishing a relief well to cap the leak. It's more than 8,000 feet down. When we intercept the leaking well, we basically have to hit the size of about a watermelon. We've got to be very exact. Once the leak is fixed, the bigger question, what to do with the gas? Shut it down! People clearly want this well and this area as a whole shut down. There's a lot of emotion and passion out there. Gas storage is an integral part of our state's energy environment, not just for natural gas, but for electricity. So then that's a no, you can't shut it down. What I'm saying is it's necessary to serve the residents that live here as well as the 21 million consumers that we serve throughout all of the Los Angeles Basin. Last week, California Congressman Brad Sherman said the gas company needs to get its priorities straight. They may think that this natural gas is an asset. For those of us in Porter Ranch, we view it as a toxin. Methane is not a toxin. Nosebleeds, nausea, headaches, things that are unexplainable by doctors. I mean, it doesn't go away, though. The odorant that people are smelling that's unfortunately causing a lot of this inconvenience is a short-term issue for people. Once we finish solving the leak and closing the well, the issues go away. But with constant hearings, the issues facing the gas company won't end anytime soon. Mireya Villarreal, CBS News, Porter Ranch.